So uh, Seven Wonders, it started with a, a phone call with Brett Ratner and Bo Flynn, who are producers in Hollywood, directors. Brett had been a producer on 21, uh, my movie, and uh, he basically said, uh, I've got a story idea, it's fiction, but if you can build a book out of the seven wonders of the world, um, that would be cool. And that's essentially where it started. And so I had always been obsessed with Egyptology and the history of religions and the kind of Da Vinci Code type of, of mystery. Um, and so I developed this, this storyline about the seven wonders. And as I dug into each of the seven wonders, I found some really m strange things. And that's where it came from. Obviously, traveling the world is a, is a fun part of a, a book like this. But um, I've been fascinated by uh, historical um, basis of, of these bizarre architectural wonders for a long time. So all of my life, I've been obsessed with pyramids. And I've been obsessed with things like Stonehenge. And I've been obsessed with... Uh, um, the Colosseum, and so it fed right into something that I'd always had a passion for. Um, and then as I dug into it, I found out some really weird stuff. Jack is, uh, he's an anthropologist who's obsessed with kind of ancient cultures. Um, and he's an adventurer, he's a real Indiana Jones type of guy um, who will dive in head first. He has a brother, a twin brother, who's sort of the geeky math science MIT nerd. Um, the type of guy that I know well, um, who's a, a mathematician and a scientist who discovers a strange connection between the seven wonders of the world. And uh, Jack gets caught up into this, this conspiracy um, and, uh, and has to sort of dive in headfirst to figure out what's going on. So this is going to be the first in a trilogy. Um, it's a, a, a big thriller uh, around this, this character, Jack, who's a, a, an adventurer, I guess, a modern-day adventurer, um, you know, anthropologist obsessed uh, with cultures, and it's going to be uh, spanning uh, multiple books. This was an incredible writing experience for me. Uh, I, I loved every minute of it, being able to dive into a thriller like this, getting into sort of, you know, learning about things that I knew nothing about. You know, the research isn't different. Um, for me, reality and fiction uh, are all kind of based in the same uh, research strategies, the way I go inside of it. Um, so in that respect, it was similar, but being able to sit and, and uh, envision the whole storyline uh, on my own um, was amazing. You know, it, I felt untethered. Although a lot of people have felt that I've been untethered all along, I feel now much more free uh, to write something I wanted to write. And I loved it. I absolutely loved it.